Hi, I'm Jeep. Thanks for taking the time to watch my channel. Here's a little tour of the Jeep camper setup I have uh, with the frame that I built and uh, two platforms on top that gives me plenty of extra storage room at the bottom for my camping gear and anything else I need when I'm going on my adventures. And if you've seen my previous videos, you'll see um, what I actually take when I go camping. And I added these panels also for added uh, sleeping area room. So if I have someone that wants to camp with me that's over 5 foot 11 or 6 feet, they're good to go. Enjoy. This is my first time actually on a ferry. I've never been on a ferry, so this is pretty cool. Uh, I hope they start letting us on now. I've been waiting here for about 20 minutes, so check it out. Sorry for the dirty windows, the trip down here. <laughs> Alright y'all, I made it, and uh, here's the spot, it's pretty awesome, it's got a shower and everything, let me show you, I didn't know I was going to have a table, that's awesome, look at the sunset, the sun is setting, I'm going to try to get to the beach so I can get an awesome sunset video, and then here's the outdoor shower, and that's exactly the shampoo I use. Yeah. This is pretty dope. All right, let's go to the beach so I can get an awesome view of the sunset. Let's go. YouTube. What is up, yo? Oh yeah, smash. <laughs> All right, I just took a shower. That shower was cold. <laughs> we get used to it and you know, it's whatever. I'm gonna go ahead and um, explore the beach area and see how far I can drive um, south and then I may head back up north to see what's out there. 
I'm trying to look for a porta potty that I can use um, when I, you know, get up in the morning or in the evenings. <laughs> so I'm gonna go and find a restroom so I can do my business. <laughs> Found the restroom <laughs> and it's pretty gross, but you know, heck, it's the beach. What are you gonna do when? Pass is needed or a permit is needed to drive on the beach. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Apparently there is not a permit needed to drive, but there is a permit needed to park. There are a lot of people camping on the side of the beach, which is awesome. I didn't know that you could. I knew that you could on the other side of Galveston Island, but not on this side. Good to know. Okay, so I found this spot right here. I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, just chill here, lay in the back, and uh, watch a movie and watch this scene there. Oh, yeah, so I'm gonna relax and enjoy my time. I hope you guys are enjoying yours and I hope you're liking my adventure so far because you are along with it. All right, here we go. Hi, everybody. Hi, uh, I'm chilling here. I took a small nap, and uh, yeah, it's just been so peaceful, and I needed it. I took a nap, and I feel good. I drove out to Galveston, and normally my adventures are about three hours from Dallas. I don't like to go any further than that, just because uh, to save miles on my Jeep, and I know there's a lot of cool spots around Dallas that are three hours away. But this was an exception. Um, it was well needed and very peaceful. And I haven't been to the beach in a long time. And I hope you guys are enjoying the footage and all that good stuff for those of you who can't make it to the beach or don't live close to the beach. I mean, for those of you that live more than 10 hours from a body of water. <laughs> yeah, so I'm gonna go to the back to the camp and uh, use the restroom and uh, pick up some snacks and then I'm going back to the beach so I can get footage of the sunset so I can share with y'all.
sun's gone down and I'm headed back. And uh, yeah, so enjoy the rest of your night. I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my night.